Hello everyone and welcome to our new video where today we are going to be checking out the top 5 best soundbars. I made this list based on my personal opinion and I've tried to list them on the middle price range but they that you get good value from and yeah you can find links to all these soundbars down in the description below so if you want more information about them you can go check them out. Ok so let's start with the list. At number 5 we have the Q Acoustics Media 4. The Q Acoustics Media 4 is an amazing soundbar with a built-in subwoofer which basically eliminates the extra boxes and cables and that makes everything much smoother and better looking. This soundbar comes with a wall bracket so if your TV is mounted to the wall you can mount this soundbar too. This soundbar uses BMR loudspeaker drive units and that means that it delivers outstanding sonic performance and also can spread the sound across a wide area so basically this means even if you have a large room this soundbar will be able to fill the whole room with quality sound. Overall it's a great product and it doesn't cost too much. So I would recommend this to everyone that's looking to buy an affordable soundbar but that uh, fills the needs of the buyer. And number 4 we have the Yamaha Yes 203. This 34, uh, 35 inch wide soundbar is a pretty good option for people that are looking for a soundbar that can fill a medium to large room with loud and clear sound. It has a pretty large subwoofer and it produces amazing bass as a result. It comes with a very simple and straightforward remote control from which you can control the subwoofer and the soundbar. You can even download the home theater controller application on your phone to control it directly from there. Overall this soundbar is very good looking, durable and it's easy to set up and the only downside I see is that there is no HDMI connection but if you never used it before you probably won't need to use it again and that shouldn't be a really good big problem because personally for me it isn't. Moving on at number 3 we have the Vizio SB3851C0. Vizio is pretty famous uh, and reputable brand in television business and they seem to be doing a pretty good job with soundbars too. The Vizio SB3851 is an amazing and affordable 38 inch soundbar which provides 100 decibels of crystal clear sound. It comes with a wireless subwoofer so that's a big plus for this product because no one wants a lot of wires near their TV, right? The Vizio also offers Bluetooth with aptX compatibility for streaming from tablets and phones. So if you want to stream music to it from your phone, you can do it easily. The bass is amazing, the design is amazing and everything about it is amazing. So if you're looking for a good one, definitely go with the Vizio. At number 2 we have the Bose SunTouch uh, 300. The Bose SunTouch 300 soundbar is a pretty slim soundbar which can play really loud sound and that sound is very clear and spacious. This soundbar features the quiet port technology which visually eliminates distortion so you can hear surprisingly deep ba bass, while the Bose Face Guide technology makes you believe you're hearing sounds where there are no speakers. I personally love the design on this soundbar because it has a glass top and a really good looking front which definitely makes it a stunning soundbar. It has HDMI connectivity with 4K pass through which can make your music, movies and TV amazing. Bose is really good at audio products and they definitely did a great job with this soundbar. And at number 1 we have the Sonos Playbar and I would say definitely uh, deserves the number 1 spot. If you're unfamiliar with the concept and never used a high fidelity wireless speaker device before, Sonos is one of the companies in the world that creates these wireless hubs that allow you to sync music and other content to a speaker. The playbar is almost 3 feet in length and features a simple, elegant and beautiful design. The bar itself is created really nicely, the construction and the materials used on the device are top notch. It feels very solid and high quality. There are 9 speakers in the device and once you see it you'll realize that it's not a cheap soundbar. It's very easy to use, produces amazing sound that I personally loved and has an amazing design. So if you have the money and want to invest in a good soundbar, definitely go with Sonos Play Bar because, I, because you won't regret it. Thank you for watching the video guys, I hope you liked it. You can find links to these soundbars down in the description below. And if you have any questions about them, leave a comment down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.